Hey guys, it is Tuesday and well actually it's Tuesday afternoon and I have a photo shoot but in the meantime I've got the kid's suit, his tuxedo out because he lost a button. Well he didn't lose it, it just came off. So now I have to put a button back on and all I have is this tiny little bit of black thread. And you can't like just get all ratchet and put like red thread or whatever. I have an abundance of different colors but... So, yeah. Oh, and it's the worst type of buttons. Actually, these are easy kind of buttons in that you can just like slip it through the back and keep knotting over and over. But I prefer the ones with holes in them just, just for time's sake. First thing I'm going to do is take my tiny little bit of thread oh, and make a little knot. It's hard for me to make knots now that I'm getting older and my fingers are, especially on my left hand, my fingers aren't as nimble as they used to be when I was younger. But luckily for a button, you don't need much to make a knot. So it's kind of like a slip knot, but not really. I mean, I'm not a boy scout, but close enough. And... You can see kind of like the imprint where the button used to be and there's still thread there. So I'm just going to use that thread. I'll pull that thread out after I'm done, but I'm just going to use that thread to, to like line up the button. It's hard to actually do it and show you at the same time. Like I said, I wish there was a way that you could actually see what I'm doing, but... I'm not that great of a YouTuber. And I'm gonna, I mean, my thread, my black thread isn't that, it's cheap, okay? That's, there's no other way around it. It's cheap black thread. So I'm gonna do it quite a few times so that it will stay through the concert. Now he gives this suit back to the school after tonight's concert, so I'll never have to be worried of this thing again. Yay! But... You don't want to give it back to them all ratchet. Be that parent, right? Like, why? That's pretty tight. So now all I have to do... Of course, I wouldn't have no scissors. Now I got to bite into it like they used to do in the old days. I'm going to just put y'all on pause while I do that. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could have showed you guys me biting it, but I don't know. Okay, so I tied it. It's pretty tight. Ta -da! It's done. Okay. It hangs right. Of course, his jacket, like, swallows me, but... I just needed to make sure that it hung right. And that's it. That's how you sew a button on. Hey guys, it is Wednesday. Um, the shoot went well last night. What am I doing? I'm spraying my hair because I have a severe case of bed head in the back because I've been laying around. I told you when it rains, I don't, I don't feel good. Like it hurts my body so bad. So I've just been like laying around all day. So now I've got like flat head in the back. So I have to like moisturize my wash and go from yesterday so that it won't be like stuck. This is just, did I tell you what was in here already? I don't know. Um, it's Empire Night and I didn't used to watch Empire. I literally catch it like every other... Wednesday. I don't know. Lately, I've been able to catch it here and there. Somebody has a DVR. I don't have DVR. I haven't stepped into this century yet. But, um, but somebody that I know does, and so we always watch it over there. It's not really hard to follow. Like, as a person who doesn't normally watch Empire, did not see the first season, I did not follow it. I can't even tell you how many seasons it's been on. But I can tell you that the episodes that I've seen, I've not been like, oh my gosh, what happened? 
I totally, I totally get it. Like, it's not like the plot twists are so deep that I'm just like, what? What happened? I don't know. But then I've got friends that just can't see some of the things that happen on Empire coming. They just can't see it coming. It takes them totally by surprise. They would never have guessed. I'm not saying I can predict the next episode. I'm just saying if you miss three to five episodes, you're not going to be completely lost. But I like the show. <laughs> He's eating raw hot dogs, y'all. Yeah, that was what you started with, but what's over there under that napkin? <clears throat> it's my napkin. Let's see it. <coughs> There's a raw hot dog under there. <laughs> <coughs> hey guys, it's Thursday afternoon. And I have about an hour to take a nap. I'm learning lines for an audition tomorrow. This is a satin pillowcase, so I no, I didn't put my natural hair on just a pillow. But um, yeah, I'm kind of tired, so I'm going to be resting today. And uh, not doing too much except for laying around in the bed and trying to memorize lines for my audition tomorrow. And that's about it. I always pay for it. Like, whenever I do, like, a shoot or something like that, I pay for it physically. Plus, it's been raining like crazy. And that, I told you, that hurts. So I paid for it a lot yesterday. Um, so I'm hoping today will be, like, a recoup day. So, yeah, that's all that's going on here. And I probably won't vlog tonight. And if I do vlog tonight, it'll be on Monday's vlog. I'll see you guys later. Have a good rest of the week.